Hello! I look pale as hell. I literally look like the color of that cabinet. I think I look whiter than the color of that cabinet. Long time no see. I kind of forgot how to talk on camera, if I'm going to be honest. Happy New Year. Um... I don't even know where to start with this video because it's been what feels like years since I have genuinely talked to you guys and I know I've uploaded I don't even know when the last time I uploaded was like within the last year but I don't know I just I didn't like I haven't liked any of the videos that I've uploaded in like the past I don't know year or two probably so basically i just wanted to sit down and make this video to say that one of my goals for 2020 is to get back into my youtube channel and to um start making videos again that are genuinely me when i first started youtube i started it as like a hobby i loved just like um photography, videography, the editing process, just like all of that was the reason that I started. Also just because I was interested in hair and makeup and clothes and all of that stuff as well. But mainly because of, it started photography before I even started a YouTube channel. I had like a Tumblr and all that old jazz. Um, and that's like really where it started and that was like something I was really passionate about which I think is why I became successful on YouTube because I wasn't in it. I was, it was like, I'm almost 21 so I started in like, I think like five or six years ago, 2015 maybe? It was a while back and that was kind of like right around or like right before YouTube kind of popped off and like everyone and their moms got a channel. Um, so like I wasn't in it or I didn't start it for the fame or for the money or anything like that. It was just a hobby. So that's what I did and eventually my videos started to get more views and I gained subscribers obviously I'm at like 250,000 or something like that around there I haven't looked at it in so long so that was when my video started blowing up that was when I was like 15 16 years old um so obviously what I was posting was a lot different than what I would be posting nowadays because I turned 21 in two months or a month and a half so like I've grown up a lot and I just I guess where I'm going with this is one of my goals for 2020 is to start my YouTube channel back up and just post whatever I want and to stop being perfectionist about things because it got to the point where I did grow out of the like makeup tutorials and the DIYs and the mornings in my life routine videos and stuff like that. I grew out of it. So I tried making different types of videos that were like maybe popular at the time or just something to try and keep it going. But I never really liked any of those videos that I uploaded. None of them really got a ton of views, which is like not what I want. I just like it got to a point where I was just like over it kind of because I don't know like it was hard because I was pretty successful there for a while and I did get a lot of views I was making money and then it all kind of just went away because the content that I was making wasn't what my viewers necessarily wanted but it also wasn't what I wanted either so it kind of just like seemed pointless to me if that makes sense I just got, I don't, I don't know, there's just so much to say 
and I don't even know how to put it into a video because I haven't really like wrote anything down. I've thought about it a lot just because obviously YouTube was a big part of my life for two or three years and like to just kind of stop was weird and I kind of never thought I was going to come back to it. I kind of just thought I grew out of it. But I genuinely love like the whole process of video making. So that's the reason I'm going to get back into it and just because I liked having a platform to reach out to people and I don't know, inspire people, talk to people. Um I don't know, it was fun. But this time around, it's going to be different. I'm not going to put on a front and try to, like, be PG, like, not cuss. Like, I cuss a lot, I'm not going to lie. Obviously, I'm not going to be sitting here, like, swearing every other word. But, like, I'm probably not going to avoid it. And I'm probably not going to, like, bleep shit out anymore. I want to be real on here. I want to film stuff that I... That I like, that I would watch, that I just put a lot of effort into. Um, I'm just gonna kind of do it for me and do it for memories and like vlogs and all that. Um, it's been hard because I did, I have tried vlogging in college a few times, but I found myself just like not really filming a whole lot, just kind of like bits and pieces, so it made it really hard to edit anything and get anything that was like quality content um but I also found out that it's really hard to film in college period because I'm kind of on the same routine every day and every week because I have the same class schedule every week so I'm like I don't know I just didn't want the videos to be super repetitive at all yeah I've just had a lot of doubts in the past year or two and just gone through a lot in just life in general just because this age is pretty tough. If you're around my age, you know that like when you get to around your 20s or like 18, 19, whatever, shit's hard sometimes. Like you're emotional, you're going through just a wild time, just ups and downs and... I don't know, it's just a weird time in your life where shit's just crazy, I feel like. I'm gonna do it. I'm motivated to keep up with it and just do it as a hobby again. Like when I started off my channel, just do it because I enjoy doing it, not because I need to keep getting money or subscribers or views or anything like that. Because. I started being like that and I wasn't genuine. I was just trying to do what everyone else was doing and trying to, I don't know. This is really rambly and I'm really sorry for it because I know I'm going to watch all this back and I'm going to be annoyed already and be like, I'm not doing this, but I'm going to. I'm sticking to my word. Um, so yeah, I guess this is just going to be my first video back up in 2020. Because I feel like it's already going to be long enough with me sitting here talking. I need to go get this film developed. So if you are an old subscriber, um, feel free to stick around. Obviously, you don't have to. If you liked my old content better, um, it's not what it's going to be anymore. So if you... D if <laughs> feel free to stay and come along with my life in 2020. It's a new deck. <coughs> oh God. It's a new decade. I am ready for a fresh start. I am ready to just prosper. I feel good things coming for some reason. Um, which hopefully it's not just a feeling and hopefully good things do come in the future. You guys understand where I'm coming from. I hope you can support me still if you want to. That's what's going to be happening this year. I'm back. I'm better than ever. You better watch out. I'm just kidding. You don't need to watch out. I'm not that scary. That's all that I have to say. 
um but look forward to new videos coming soon hopefully hopefully deuces bye